Alright guys, welcome back to the couch. Let's go ahead and get our foot race with Sir Puffington here underway. Now you'll love this, he's got a Mary Poppins thing going on, so you're pretty much just going to take off after him. Uh, you, there is fire hanging out in Deku Scrubs, just go ahead and literally ignore them, go around them. Uh, you don't want to waste any time chasing after him. And as I said, with the bunny hood, it's real easy to keep up with him because you'll do pretty good jumps and flips and things like that. Um, it also makes it easier to catch up to him. If I didn't just lose him here. There we go. I'm having little issues today, I guess. There we go. Yeah, if you can keep up with him, it makes it pretty easy. That's where that bunny hood comes in handy because you jump a little farther each time. And if you ever pass him, uh, get ahead of him, he literally just speeds up and gets ahead of you again. So there's not really a whole lot of benefit to speeding past him. Oh, this part I freaking hate. He goes a little slower here because he knows it's a little difficult to get through. But then again, he'll start taking off right again once he gets up here. So do your best to stay on them, especially this part here, because uh, you can see the flame walls pop up. But yeah, not too bad. This is the part where you need to stay on the stairs as much as possible, because you will just slide back down and it sucks. Ugh, I forgot about the boulders. And he immediately goes to the left path here, which he's tried to confuse me with before. But it's not too bad. Okay, here you need to whip out your bow really fast. Should have had that ready to go already. That's what I, uh, what I love about in Majora's Mask is the fact that Link's a little more agile, a little more uh, acrobatic. Do his time, do his adventures in Ocarina of the Time, I would imagine. So he does all the little cool flips and cartwheels and things. Alright, here we go. I believe we'll use this in the mountains once we get there, but I'm not I'm not entirely sure. Because I think you use it to sniff out another mask. Alright, so we're done here. Go ahead and just step into light. We'll get out of here. Now we're going to go do another mini game back at where the boat hut lady is. She, uh, does an archery game with you to get another heart piece. Um, I may fail that terribly several times. You just have to shoot all the targets off her room and we'll get another heart piece really fast. And I've already looked up a little ahead to get some other heart pieces that are in Clock Town and uh, they involve playing the game every, all three days to get. And they get really, 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 really hard. So those two that I've read about, I'm not even going to bother with. I'll show you where they are so you can go get them yourself. But beyond that, not happening. So now, there's a palace. we got to shoot back over here. I'm going to see use... Deku scrub here. Oop, close one. What's in here? Oh, it's the spider house. We're not doing anything with them yet. Um, you know what? We're just gonna use our song of soaring. And we'll get back there twice as fast, so we're not wasting time trying to run, so I have more time to show you the minigame.
Southern Swamp. That's the one we want. Now, after the first time you view videos like this, uh, except with the exception of the Song of Time, you can just skip it each time, so it just cuts you there really fast. The Song of Soaring is not a long animation anyway, so if you're patient, you're patient. If you're not, you're not. So we're going to go ahead and run back into the boat shop here. And if you already took the picture of the king, now's the time to get that heart piece as well. And I know there's a heart piece on top of the house there, but we haven't come to the point where we can get that one just yet. Here we go. Now we're going to try uh, the mini game. You have infinite arrows, and the first time is free, so hopefully I can do it without hitting her, you know, multiple times. I think you can hit her ten times. There's that one. So I'm assuming this one goes for the entirety of the cruise all the way back to the boat. Where they, uh, they first take on the boat here. I'm not doing too bad. Where the hell did she go? There she is, right in front of my face. Jesus. Shot that one through the dark, apparently. Doing too bad here, not doing too bad. Again, shooting through the darkness here. All right, so we got through. I'm not sure we need to do this here. Oh, there we go. I would say uh, try to get at least 20. Uh, then she'll give you the heart piece there. So there's that one. So now I think that's all we can do in the swamp here. Let me talk with him real quick and see what he wants. Ah. Okay, so to get the heart piece from here you need to bring the deed from the clock town to this guy and he'll let you get up there to get it okay so now what we're gonna do is warp back to clock town because there's nothing more for us here we're gonna go deposit all our rupees because we have quite a bit here and then we're going to do a little more item hunting. Okay, so we'll go drop some stuff off and then uh, we'll try another... Uh game with the postman because he's here between 6 p.m. and 8 a.m. or 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. on uh, pretty much every day. I already have quite a bit of rupees in there. That's good. So let's drop off the 113... I guess I can drop them all in there. I keep thinking I can only put 200 in there. Uh, and every time he's going to give you... Every time you hit 200, he'll give you another 5 rubies. So we'll drop in... 
We'll just drop in 60 because we're going to need at least a little bit here to play the game with the postman. Since it's, we got the time here, let's go ahead and just take care of it since we're still on the first day. I figure we'll do a bunch of item hunting, then I'll come back and deposit everything else. So the postman's place is just over here. I believe. I might be in the wrong spot now. Yeah, I think that's the mayor's house. Yep. Yep. Alright. So we'll run back over here real fast. Okay, so one of the games I was talking about that's uh, you have to play all three days, you'll use the flower here to drop in there. And you'll do a, a rupee game, and you have to beat your record every single day. So you don't want to do too well as you're going through it, but um, it gets a little hard because you're timed at the same time, and you have to do it all as the Deku Scrub. Okay, so here... There it is. Go into the post office here, play his little game, uh, which we're going to go ahead and do on the next episode. Yeah, there he is, just chilling. So, uh, yeah, we'll come back here, mess with the postman a little. Let's uh, see you back on the couch.